All right, everybody, welcome. We're doing one ones only again. Uh, as it sounds, you can only start every combat with a you know with a team of one ones. So everything has to have one and one attack and one HP. Other than that, all food goes. Uh, anything goes to the shop phase, and sloth is allowed to scale. So go crazy on that front. And oh, hey, a good start. Almost ideal start. The only thing that would be better is having like more of them ready in the shop, or another honey. Okay, save. And a B. Bees are also 1 1. Okay, solid. Maybe I should have just bought that egg, actually. I'm going to roll because I'd rather have honey. I'd rather have one of these than that, but yeah. <laughs> uh, no, I don't think I freeze these because if, remember, guys, if you combine stuff together, it will turn into a 2 2. So you can't combine and level stuff up normally. You have to do weird stuff with stoat and mushroom pill. So be very careful about that. Let's just make sure that everything's looking fine. Which it is solid. A lot of people didn't find anything on the first turn. Okay. And hey, a win. And it doesn't even cost aspect anything. So I just get a trophy. Cool. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'm just going to hard roll from cherries and stoats. That is all I am interested in. Yeah, I will buy a cherry. Freeze this one. Let's see if I can find another stove first. I can buy a guinea pig, and it's kind of a cheap way to get more, but not that bothered. And I'm just going to shuffle everything to the back and send it again. Oh, no. I cheat. Wait, I think I'm fine here. I am. Cool. All right, safe. Safe, safe. I'm going to find a stove as well, please. Something cool. <laughs> Why? Why give me a guinea pig? Oh my god, game. Okay, freeze you. I know I could just buy both of these, but I don't want to. I'd much rather find more stoats. Yeah, so I'll worry about buying that next turn. Uh, no, actually, stay there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, wait. This is a pretty similar team to what I have. Yeah, it's draw. Awesome. Anything that isn't me losing HP, I'm pretty happy with. Okay, so let's sell this one, buy sell you. An Osprey. It's not amazing, but it's a lot better than the rest of the stuff I have, so <laughs> happy to see it anyway. And yeah, I may just buy a ton of avocados, because... Do I go for another one? Hmm. What can I get from tier 4 that'd be cool? Parrot could be nice. Uh, Cuttlefish actually could be really cool, but again, I can't really level it. Actually, yeah, getting a tier 3 might be better than the next stuff, so I'm going to sell one of these and do it now. A sheep, amazing. Okay. Send that then, see what this does. Uh, <laughs> that's a little bit worrying. Yeah. Okay, I have lost some HP. Fair enough. Okay, more guinea pig. No, I need avocados and stoats. I think that's all I'd be looking for here. Yeah. Avocado, sure. More of this. No. I could maybe chocolate cake my sheep. It might be slightly better. In fact, it's probably worth it on the osprey. But I'd rather just save my gold and get rid of it again later. So, yeah. For now, just hold out what we're doing. Can worry about it later. Yo. <laughs> Surgeon fish is interesting. It's pretty interesting, sorry. Yeah, these terrify me. If you have a lot of summons, then that thing can really mess you up. Looking good so far. So it's running a bee. Popped a nice. Wait, there's another bee. People are actually pilling things to get bees. That's hilarious. <laughs> no, they had the egg value. And then there's no. Never mind. Haha. -ha. Alright, safe. Okay, dear, yes. Alright, let's get rid of the Frill Dragon. Or not. I need a backline, and I can't have a backline that generates trumpets, so maybe get rid of you, then buy this. And it's nice that I can leave it to the front, so I'm definitely giving it to Chocolate Cake. I can, like, pill two slugs. Or, you know, a slug twice to get it, like, really low. 
I don't think I will, but you know, it's, there's something to it. And then I don't think I buy more avocados. There's still stuff I'm looking for here. Hmm. Okay. For now, I'm going to keep rolling for stoats and deer, but just having one of these at the front, I think, should do me pretty well to start. I'm hoping. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they did manage to snipe it before it's, um, it could level up, but it was not a problem. Stop giving me these. And these, not interested. Deer and stoats. Yes. All right, you're the next to go. Grab another one of these. I may shuffle it back a little bit, but still pretty happy. Don't really need avocados. Like, I like getting these deer, and they are very, very strong. You know, one of the best things to just grab immediately. But, you know, it's more interesting when you get stoat things, you know? Getting things you don't buy directly from the shop and instead have some random other ones. I do think I should remake this pack at some point, though. Because I added in a load of other one ones that you can buy as they are. You know, scorpion, microbe, these guys, etc. But I don't actually feel like they're that interesting. So it may be better to get rid of them and just have more things that you can get from stoats and mushroom pill. Just so you find, like, less dud ones later. You have three deer, a parrot, and a lynx. Oh my god. No, they killed my dudes. I mean, I'm still fine, but... <laughs> Damn, a weakness bus. Interesting. Okay, so nothing I can do here. I'm not touching these still. Uh, another deer, fine. Get rid of you. So I still can't really do anything with chocolate unless I find a stoat. You know what? I'm doing it. I'm trying to find a stoat and I will level it up and I'll accept whatever it gives me. There it is. Okay, next turn I can do this then. Is that or I wait until tier 6? Which is also a maybe. Wouldn't be that upset about it. Like, what can I find from tier 5? Because if it turns into one of these, then it really sucks. A Rhino could be great if I have a Stego on my team and, you know, direct it to hit the Rhino every time. Without Lionfish, is going to be that good. Vulture could be amazing. Uh, Nile and Nurshark is a maybe. I don't know. Oh, damn, they have a Nyala and a lot of deer. Uh, yeah, that's bad. Okay. 3 HP. 3 HP. I, I'm going to do it now. I never go for the tier 5s, and there are a lot of good tier 5s. There's only like a 1 in 5 of this completely screw me over, so I'll, I'll trust it. <laughs> Let's try then. No! <laughs> Oh, I shouldn't have trusted it. Yeah, that's, I think that's a good reason to get rid of this. I know I can give it that, but I'd rather just roll for more stoats. Or deer. <laughs> I can sell it for the deer. It just, everything feels bad. Okay, let's run it like this then. What does the cherry do? It summons a 2-2 at the end of, end of my team when everything's dead. This could be okay. Actually, no, it's definitely okay. Yeah, I have too many buses. They can't deal with it. Okay, so... I can try Mushroom Pill stuff, and... From last time, it seemed like that was a pretty good idea, so I may just go for that, too. What about Nurshark? Yeah, let's just keep rolling. There's lots of things I can look for. White Tiger can be great. Because you get two things to, like, level three. I think I'll freeze that. I need to find a pill, though. Maybe it's a... I'm going to freeze this anyway. <laughs> Another deer. Nah. Nah, we're fine. Stego is also a pretty big yes, I think. Okay, I may start with Stego, because that's something I'm going to need. And then I can try and get a tiger so I can tiger Stego. And then I can worry about white tiger later, maybe. But I don't know. Maybe white tiger is just better than regular tiger. In this um, situation, at least. Okay, still going. My, <laughs> my swarm of deer are definitely doing it. Okay, let's get rid of one of these, then. Unless it is you. I feel like this is probably the weak thing. So, yeah, let's just get rid of that. Mushroom pill, you. 
There you go. We have a thing, and then I'm just going to... Not yet. Next turn, maybe. Kind of want to put popcorn in there, but I won't freeze it. Uh... Okay, so I can try and level it up. Might take a little while, but maybe. Yeah, I'm just going to leave it like this. Uh... <laughs> well, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe unfreeze all of those. I know I can chocolate this, but again, I'd have to like mushroom and then freeze the chocolates and roll for a pill. I think I'd rather just mushroom that as soon as I can. And then I can just roll for another stego somewhere on the left side and then, you know, level up with two stegos, then give it to pill at the same time. Snake behind a deer would be good. It'd be okay. I feel like it's too lightly to just explode for no reason. Ouch. It's a draw, never mind. Never mind, that looked like it may have been kind of bad, but yeah, we got there. I wanted these. I don't mind freezing these. Also, I don't know whether I should throw one of those down, but I'd rather not. I don't really want to give it chocolate cake either. I want to try and look for other things. So yeah, I'm going to freeze this pill. Now if I find chocolate or another stego, then I'm ready. Yeah, so I can level this up next turn, which is huge. Uh, kind of want to throw one of these to the front just in case. Maybe do it like that, just so I do have my bigger things towards the front, so I can have you at the back. So maybe I'll get lucky, and if other people are running frontline deer, then maybe this one will get really big, and they won't actually immediately die to um, their sweep damage. 30 rolls, no stoat. Very relatable. Look at this, there's so, many, like, so much variety. Triple tier 6. Yeah, there are deer everywhere, but it's nice seeing it. We're fine. We're fine. I got like four hits in or something from that bus. <laughs> Absolutely huge. Okay. Okay, so I am going to be leveling this. And then I pill it again. And now I have a level 2 1 1 Stego. Excellent. I'm going to keep the Stoats frozen because I could do it individually, maybe. But it's also so much work. I think I'd rather take the gamble. Like, there's a lot of good stuff at this tier. So yeah, I'm just going to wait. Again, popcorn in there is good, but I need chocolate or something. At least that's what I want. This would also be great, but yeah, I just, I just don't know anymore. Think I'm going to skip it. I want to move you a white tiger. But yeah, having a white tiger is really cool. Having, oh god, like white tiger tranodon. Very spooky. Even this, I wonder how that's working now. It's probably big enough to kill normal buses. No, it'd have to be level 2 to kill normal buses. Like, look at this. Massive deer cannot be destroyed. <laughs> the strongest thing in this lobby is just to have big stats. Okay. Stop giving me this. I can't do anything with it. Okay, I will buy a popcorn, because I think that kind of had to happen anyway at some point. And yeah, I can do my stoat stuff soon as well. Maybe just buy one of these for now. And I sort of guarantee that it hits that. It does risk me dying to something. Like, if someone starts with snipers somehow, you know, like, start a combat snipers and kills my one thing without equipment, then it may ruin it. But I think having an extra thing down is better than not. So let's just try it. You can do it there. I don't know. It's more likely to die to sweep damage, but also want it to actually get its thing to pop off. So makes it a little bit more likely. You can use White Tiger on your Octo. I should have done that in my last... Um, the last time we played this, I tried... I, I went out of my way to try and get a regular Tiger instead of just using a White Tiger. And the White Tiger would have been a lot easier for me to set up, I think. So, yeah. I don't think it's a crazy play. <laughs> I think that's a pretty good one. And hey, sub. Alright, so I'm going to try this. I know it's probably going to be bad, but... Yeah, let's see what this turns into. And it's a snake. That is... Uh, I just want better luck. Yeah, I need to redo these packs. <laughs> I think a snake is not going to be it. I'll leave him back here, but... Yeah. Alright, at least I can popcorn him again. No, I can't, because then Stego won't pop in anything. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to freeze popcorn, and I may just try and swap in some other thing. I'm hoping I can find a... um. I don't even know. I don't want to do that. I know it's the easiest thing to swap in, but I want to find a regular stoat so I can get rid of another deer. Hmm. 
Hey. <laughs> that was a lot of deer. And hey. My snake is amazing, never mind. Sneak behind tomato deer for two snipes. I mean, it gets two snipes from this, plus it may turn into summoners like it did. Hey, there we go. I found a stoat. So I can put this on there if I want. I think I will. I think you're probably the worst of my deer, so I'm going to get rid of you. Yeah. Get rid of you. See what this turns into. It's an orca. Amazing. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually kind of like my snake now, because this is both going to be a very big orca, and it's going to... um. Yeah, have a snake behind it, so I I love that. Let's see if I can level it up. Not that it really benefits the snake, but it just benefit me in general. Okay. I'm gonna freeze this, but no. Never mind, I'm not. <laughs> I I don't need to. I just need to find a mushroom and a pill, and then I can do it all in one turn. So that's fine. Can a stoat give a stoat? I don't think so. Because then there would definitely be a risk of it going infinite somehow. And I didn't really get my thing to pop off as I wanted there, but that still went pretty well. Alright. So yeah, freeze that. I can't give it to it, otherwise it's going to ruin my team. I just need to find a pill as soon as possible. Hmm. Pill, please. No, okay. Okay, send it again then. I can maybe try moving these further forward. It may be a good idea just to have this right at the front. I'm a little bit afraid of, like, you know, deer spam stuff. Yeah, I think potato is better for for the snake than popcorn. You might be right there. I probably should do it. I'm just wondering where I should leave it, though. If I have it in the second position, I'm worried that it's just going to die to sweep damage because I don't know if um, potato protects from deer stuff. If it does, then <laughs> heavily on board with doing that, I think. Yeah, it keeps getting sniped. Yeah, I probably should do that. Uh, this is probably fine. I have a very large orca. Yeah. Yeah, no worries. Okay. Let's keep rolling. Yeah, so... <laughs> I'm going to freeze a stoat. I could also do this, but it only saves it from one hit. So, yeah, leave, ignore that. Don't need these. Stop giving me all these things. I don't, not interested. Okay, I'll freeze a potato then. We'll try it, and I'm going to try moving the orchid to the front as well. Not this turn, obviously, but soon, soon. Yeah, it's just getting sniped every turn. <laughs> My snake just doesn't have a chance to do anything. And maybe it won't. There's, like, no time left in the game. All right. Let's see then. I'm going to try this at the front. And I'm still waiting for this pill, because I want to try and level up my orca. But I guess then it would ruin my stuff being at the front. Ugh, maybe I level up one of the deer instead. And I doubt I'm going to swap anything else in. Let's just, um... Let's just go. Okay, yeah, let's try and find a couple of deer then. Let's see what this does. So what team do they have? Hmm, that's going to be a lot of snipes. I do have some protection from it. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure Potato does protect from Octopus triggers. Oh. It didn't even get hit yet. <laughs> yes. Oh, it's working. That is working very well. On see you later, Buzzkill. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Uh... Is there anything else I can swap to? Because I can get any pet that I want by doing this. There may be a better thing to swap to my front. I don't know, though. Hmm. Nah, ignore Orca. Honestly, having a frontline Rhino could be really cool. <laughs> I, I may just try that instead, actually. Let's do it. Okay. I do need to find equipment, which I won't have this turn, but I can maybe get it to work next turn. So I'm going to trust that this is going to work. It's a 50-50, but... Actually, yeah, it's a 50-50 that the Stego hits the Rhino, but if it does, if it does, it could be pretty cool. It hit the Rhino! And my snake survived! Never mind, it's dead. <laughs> Come on, Rhino. Yay, Rhino! <laughs> it did it! Yo. 
All right. Hey, second win on one ones only. Very nice. Very nice. All right. GG's everyone. Good game. Good game.